With 2014 just a day away, New Year's resolutions are soon to follow. For many, that means getting into shape. And while some may go to the gym to get started, there are plenty of other ways to get fit in Stanford. Right arm over by the ear. Good. If you want to work out, go to the gym, go on the treadmill. If you want to work in, come to Harmony Yoga. Ah, and feel the breath in the belly. Carol Schwedak has been teaching yoga for 10 years. She says yoga is a great way for people to start the year off with the right mindset. Yoga is about the now. It's about the union of the mind and the body through the breath. And the breath is the most important thing because the breath brings you to the present moment. And in the present moment, you can just begin again. And you can begin again with being mindful and allowing yourself to notice, am I being good to my body? Because you know, we are what we eat. We are how we take care of ourselves. Shwedak teaches private lessons in her home studio and group lessons in a studio on Union Street. She says there's a form of yoga for everyone and it's never too late to start. You can start in every moment to begin again. It doesn't have to be like, okay, I'll wait till Monday because Monday's the beginning of a new week. No, don't beat yourself up that you didn't get to those New Year's resolutions, just begin again. For those who want to kick their New Year's resolution into a faster gear, the Dojo of Stanford may be the place. We teach uh, karate, uh, we also do Brazilian Jiu Jitsu here, and we do kickboxing. You get every aspect of, of being physically fit, your endurance, your flexibility, your strength, your speed. You're also learning uh, skill. You're learning you know, how to defend yourself or at least to have an idea of how to defend yourself. And I always tell my students the same thing all the time. I tell them I'd rather know these skills and never have to use them than to need them one day and not have any idea of what to do. As Moraldo says, martial arts training also enforces discipline, focus, and most importantly, accountability. We actually take attendance. We don't have a swipe card. And, uh, and what ends up happening is if you miss a couple of classes or you're gone for you know, a prolonged period of time, we're actually on the phone with you. Read below to find out more about the dojo and Harmony Yoga Studio. In Stanford, Samantha McKelvey, it's relevant.com.